Ooh, he's coming in. He thinks himself strong. Well, we will see. We will see. This is going to be an epic multi-part battle. Oh my god, that's so many units. To battle! Hello everyone, my name is Gracie, and this is episode 18 of this Let's Play of Age of Wonders 4 as Imola the Channeler. Uh, I forgot for a second who I was playing. Um, Alright, so let's get to it. We are currently sieging um, Logar here. And uh, so we've got Spire... Oh yeah, this is the turn where you see my income is garbage, 111 and 53. That's because I have too many cities. Let's increase the cap. And we more than doubled it. There we go. That's back to normal. So let's get some buildings going here. Um, yeah, I think the bathhouse would be a good idea. Generally, happiness is good. Uh, let's get another expansion. Now, what do we want to grab with this one? We can get Quicksilver, Basin, and the money. We can get Mana Nodes, Scrying Sanctum, and the gate itself. So this would give us... Oh, this would count as a... Oh, interesting. We'd get So we'd get 15 and 10. That would give us 30 and 5. 10 and 10, because Astral Dew... And this is just $10 for a gold vein. Well, I think it's pretty obvious we go with one of these two. Um, I'll take this one. A little bit of mana. And, yeah, I'll take it. It's fine. We can, be, we can be buddies. I mean, you can't have it. <laughs> Suck it. All right. Um, so we've got set production for the blue spy. This is our capital. Astral Echo's income, which we never need. All Seer's blessing to every unit produced. True. Vi okay. Vi all right. That's interesting. We don't really need that, though. Stone walls. The item forge. Maybe it's time for that. Free city declare war. And is that both of them? No, just one. What the heck? Damn it. I can't be friends with them. Okay. I'm not evil enough. Oh, a war. Oh, a racial war breed. Ooh. What would my upkeep be? 24 gold, 3 Imperium. I make a lot of Imperium. Let's get a Warbreed for ourselves here. A Spellbreaker of our own faction as well. Though it's 200 bucks. What does it normally cost me? I don't think I can build it yet. Oh, no, I can. Uh, normally cost me 140 bucks. So, yeah, it's not actually cheaper through the Rally of the Lieges. Can get it quickly though. I can also get the fairies. So we've got the one with the lightning and the blinding gale. So it can inflict blind. Um, in a one hex radius at range. That's pretty interesting. Let's see what Logar is. So Logar is a crocodile corsair. So he's got dry, 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 draconic, draconic vitality. So he's got extra health. Fey touched. Accuracy, so Fey Guile, okay, Obscured, and Umbral Flesh. Um, knowledge, okay. Uh, and then they're Barbarian, and they have Poisonous, Blight Resistance. Swamp Adaptation, okay. So we just don't want to be doing Blight damage to him, is really the only thing that matters. So we can get a Winter Fairy, this has the Hindering Blizzard. We've also got the Spring Fairy, which is a really fantastic, can I please look at this, please? Really fantastic support unit. It's got minus four Blight, though. They're Barbarians, so they do bonus Blight on crits. So that's a l not terribly dangerous, but like a little bit dangerous. They also deal Blight damage. So I might be better off just hanging out with my own I mean, we've got the strengthen though. Two strengthen and true strike in a one hex radius. Cannot miss. That would be interesting though for like my range units. Gosh, that's fun. Um, I don't need support units is the problem. These are battle mages, so soon they might have the extra damage. Upkeep of mana and mana. That's a bit of a problem. We'll grab the autumn fairy. And I, that's, I think that's all I'll grab. I just want to grab some of the, like, fun stuff that I can't normally get. 
We're going to finish researching. We're researching lightning fast now. I should keep pumping that up and really, like, really get crazy research going. If this city is this poorly defended, I should move out with these forces. Like, I should take three of these stacks and just go. Okay, he's got troops coming. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. Good to know. We could... We could try to make it so that he can't reinforce. So this siege would currently include, yeah, any of my stacks. So we're good there. So we might want to move you around to here and be prepared for the incoming. Yeah, so he's going to send relieving forces. So we might have a really big fight coming up here soon. Um, let me just make sure I don't have my, I don't want my reinforcements involved. So how far can he get? Let's grab his, oh my god. Let's grab his stack. He can get over to there. Yeah, so we'll just have you guys like stand up here in the mountains. You're just a couple reinforcing units. There's some, some echoes right there. Can I get there and get back? little dangerous to... I'm not going to try it. That's a little dangerous. That would be a stupid way to, to lose a fight. is because I split up stupidly for that. Um, this is good enough. I think we can do this fight here. Nope. One closer. There we go. Mostly healed up. Yeah, we can just, we can just get them healed up once we get in. Yeah, we're going to have to make heavy use of spell casting, I think. Because they have... Fewer but high quality units. Goodness. Okay, so let's check this guy's abilities. Umbral Tyrant. So he is. Uh, so he's got Umbral Oppression. Sing single magical attack on a unit deals 10% damage per friendly unit with Tyrant's Mark. So that's a 33 damage attack. And it goes up 10%. So it would be another 3. So 36 damage at the moment. And it's mixed damage. So it's hard to resist. Tyrant's Assault. Always hits. 8 range. This guy is a turret. Oh my god. Target friendly unit with Tyrant's Mark. Adjacent units sustain damage. Spread umbral taint around it. Good lord. So you have to target a unit with Tyrant's Mark. Till the end of combat. And has hastened. Which gives very fast movement. Adds in a retaliation attack. Okay. So he's going to try to get the Tyrant unit. This one. Into the middle of my units. And then use it as an explosion. It only hits adjacent enemies too, so it doesn't even friendly fire. So very good for very good for them. These are mostly umbral units, so I have to be careful. Immune to umbral malady. This one doesn't consume debuffs though. Curse eater. This guy probably has it. Curse eater. Yeah. So let's just start with a simple flame spell here. There we go. Tons of buffs. Now you need healed. This is not a soother. Hi. I'm going to move them again here in a second. Because uh -huh. I do not want to be breathed on too much here. Mm -hmm. This is an arcanist. Can't fully avoid it, but we just kind of spread out until we can get him to use his uh, breath attack. There's my fairy. I'll move that up close. Okay, I'm a little nervous about the dragon coming in. Tyrant's mark, yeah. Put 
Poisoned and decaying. Okay. Stab him! He doesn't hit too, too hard. We got bleeding from him, though. Ow. That was a Tyrant's Mark unit. Let's we'll check the cooldown on that. Strength armor. Oh boy, the taint is all over the place. <laughs> That's stupid. Okay. Uh, this does not. Oh dear, it does not have a uh, cooldown. Oh god. Uh, okay, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Uh, what was I doing? So we've got this wisp here. I could just go over here and just take some shots. Yeah. Because uh, this is a throwaway unit. So they can they can waste their time on that. Let's make an elemental. Oh, we got an icy boy. Now this guy loses debuffs at the at the start of each turn, so it's pointless to freeze it unless we have multiple debuffs on it. So I could go for this one. Oh, burning. Wait, wait. Do you not have a chance of even freezing it at all? Oh, phantasm warriors. Immunity to bleeding disease, immobilized, and poison. It's not immune to freezing, then. Well, I don't know what's going on. Let's just go in and attack. Yeah, they can they can be busy with summons for a second. So, uh, we need to cast another spell. This guy is getting a little bit screwed here. How do we fix that? We can we could try to um, we could try to take something over temporarily. Um. There we go. We still get a, a buff, and now we don't have to use... Uh, link target enemy unit. They become inflicted with umbral, umbral drain. Uh, at the end of each turn, they take 10 frost damage, lose a stack of a positive keyword. The linked unit heals, steals the positive keyword. So let's drain from the dragon. She's going to drain buffs off of the dragon. And then next turn we'll run him back there to attack the... What's this thing called? Tyrant. Yeah. Um, I've got bombs. Bombs of fire. Bomb. More bomb. Bomb. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, oh, we can, um, I should have done this on somebody before. Is this a touch? No, it's a range four, two, three, four. Uh, this guy's clear to leave. He's got a lot of, he's got bleeding and he was on the taint. Now this guy's decaying and poison, so we probably want to get him out of there too. Though it's pretty safe over here now. Um, uh, that's a summoned unit. Oh, this guy hits pretty fucking hard, doesn't he? Let's just get two umbral drains on him. Oh, maybe it can only be attached to one unit? Yeah, it looks like it. Okay, well that's interesting to know. So only only one unit can be only one unit can be linked at a time. Okay, see that's unclear because it looks like this unit can only be linked to one, but actually it's any unit can only be linked to one, including the recipient. Okay. Um, I think I'll move this guy to here. This guy to here. Berserkers, but they can't quite reach. Let's get him back to here. Block that pathway. He can still. Yeah, okay. He's constricted. He's killing his own unit.
Holy crap. That guy hits pretty damn hard. He probably has a thousand enchantments on him. Okay, throw a snowball at him. Huh. Oh, I froze him! Oh my god, I froze him! Of course, he's gonna lose that at the start of his turn for sure, right? Curse Eater, yeah. That's funny. Um, Alright, got a Pyromancer. Let's just throw some fire at these little things. Purge by fire! I miss a graze and a graze. Ah, well. What can you do? And a Constricted. This guy's going down. Charge! Mm, beat! Go ahead and fight to the death, since you're both my enemies. They're disrupting each other's buffs. <laughs> Is that an enchantment you have? Yeah, disrupting blades. Alright. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Um, I need to get need to get up to that guy. Oh no, is he gonna lose morale from units lost? Probably. I want to walk through all my own fire that I made. Oops, that's the umbral taint. Which does, loses morale and decaying if I end my turn there. Let's not do that. Let's get you over to here. Teleport across all the, all the enemy, or the units here. Well, it's hard to reach that guy. Alright, let's just end turn. I don't need to cast any more spells or anything. Can't get my phone to charge. All right, that guy's back to being an enemy. Just kill him with this. Okay, so how's your morale doing? You are, yeah, too many allies died. That makes sense. Just get a flank hit on this guy. Now he probably respects zone of control. Yes, he does. So an 85% chance on that. Let's take two shots from here. This thing is just a meat bag. 160 health. Okay. We're, we're going to get there. There we go. He's pretty much hemmed in now. I think I think this is a bit, a bit over for him. Does this hit allies? No. Yes. Yes, it does. I can't reach. Oh, sorry about this. This is a little slow. I just have to get all my DPS back here. In the end, he's probably just going to flee anyway. Which I'd prefer not to let him do. Alright, that's good. Okay, yeah, he's trying to flee. Doesn't take opportunities. My summon's gone. No, I want to kill him. I would prefer to eliminate him. Uh, it's easy to miss attacks now, unfortunately. Oh, I can do this again. Oh, uh, the exploding plants got him. <laughs> okay, so we got experience there. And we got Astral Travel. Um, that's a, okay, uh, wow. Whoa, okay. Dang, makes your leader teleport to target World Hex. So just the leader, I guess? I don't know how that works. So where do we want to go from here? We probably want to pick this up for a large amount of mana and knowledge, and then we want to get out of here. But this is also like possibly a tough fight, so we'll probably take these armies over there. Um, and uh, do the same thing. 
We'll park you guys here for one turn and then we'll go. Once again, these guys are just hovering in the same health pool the whole time. Uh, here we are waiting on them to attack me. If they do, I'll probably have to make it'll probably have to be a two-parter because um We are not gonna have enough time for that fight. It's gonna be huge. I think is this greenery Look at that. There's grass over here for some reason What the look at that what the heck? Oh, so something about the way the world is generated is confused with the edge of the map that's interesting. Huh. You have to go. Yeah, weird. Okay. I don't know. Consecrating Firestorm is done. Let's get the uh, Flamer. Oh, Fiery Arrows. No, I don't use Archers. I have one Skirmisher in my entire army. Temple of the Pyre. Ignore income and stability penalties from being under siege. The start of combat, enemies suffer condemned and plus 10 fortification health. That's pretty cool. If I was going into fort, uh, condemned stuff. Let's get this. That'll make all, I'll have <laughs> so many more fire bombs. <laughs> this is going to be great. Uh, where, what are you, where are you going? I don't know. Not my problem. Academy. Mm, yeah, Academy. Your ruler leveled up. Imola the Channeler. Uh, firebomb. Yeah, I think so. I think so. Let's go up top here. Ooh, he's coming in. He thinks himself strong. Well, we will see. We will see. This is going to be an epic multi-part battle. Oh my god, that's so many units. To battle! Oh my god, this is gonna be this is gonna be like three three battles in a row in this location. This is gonna be all of our forces killing each other in in open fields. I am gonna set fire to everything. I I am so excited. Okay. Uh, if you produce flame, please step forward. <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna be doing it a lot. Um, okay, anything I need to know. This is a level, okay, it's a level six charge hero. Not a fantastic weapon though, to be honest. Uh, got a uh, mask of star blades though. She doesn't look very healthy. Oh my God, look at her eyes moving around. What the <laughs> Okay. So we have going on here 10,000 support units. We've got war shamans, war shamans, war shamans. These are like they're going to be very buffy but not very damagey. Poison blast. Okay, well I say we just charge forward ignoring whatever's going on. We've got support units galore. Both sides have too many support units. That's fine. Do you guys have any magic origin units that I can take over? Yes really bizarre fey imp thingies and that's it oh it does lightning damage if it fails aren't they weak to lightning no they're weak to blight what else can i do this is only 12 casting points so we're going to start with just a simple little burning a simple burn spell here's berserkers i think these guys want to be set on fire oh no they lost a model so sad so very sad uh, is there, does anyone have any frontline? Okay, it's, I, I gotta send this guy over this way. Go in the middle. You are a ranged character. This is a pretty good spot for you to park. Right there behind that rock. So over here we've got several nice frontline units. So I'll send another one over this way. And you are gonna unfortunately burn everything down as you pass through, but you know, what can you do? When your soldiers are literally made of fire. All right, come at me.
Hmm. Can't believe they think this is an even fight. Huh. I scoff in your face. Mm, how much health are you guys missing? Enough. Enough. Here, have some health. Uh, we've got a hero with bolts. I should probably go and engage that one. You just go up here and just do a little tentacle pull. Come over here. Get over here. Zoop. Thank you. Constricted. Oh, prepare to be stabbed. So sad. You're a real ice elemental. How strange. Can't seem to hit that one. Is this a... It's just a warrior Go over here. Throw a snowball at him. Frozen. There we go. Nice. Oh, I should have cast a spell first. My bad. Uh, what do we want to do here? We could conjure a tentacle. Hyper awareness. Uh, we could do that like right here. And force them to keep their support units out of the fight for a while. Let's do it. Astral. Who do we want to slap? Flanked. Yeah. Constricted. Nice. So that one can't even get away. Okay. Beautiful. Oh, man. This is going to be easy. Obviously, they have like three more stacks of six, but I have more units, too. Animal. Ah, more. Yeah, let's just kill the hero. What? It said that would kill him. That was weird. Wonder why that happened. That was weird. I lost control of my camera for a really long time. We got berserkers over here, which are pretty much uh, counter shield units pretty well. Um, I might try to get. I might try to swap these positions here. Actually, now that I'm looking at it, get these guys over here to deal with the berserkers. We can't get all the way in this turn so let's just get some fire support up here oh these guys got set on fire the the fire spread and set my units on fire shoot i'm so sorry uh can i bomb them yes i can a decent spot right there burning i don't need this soothing yet uh this is an actual pyromancer oh, i could double it up Hell yeah. Okay, those archers are pretty much screwed. We are almost out of time, so I'll probably finish up this turn and then not end the turn. Mending touch. That is nice to have. This guy used his. So we'll leave you there. Oh my god, I'm in such a strong position. You guys gotta get out of the forest there. You're gonna burn to death. You got six six resistance. So you're only gonna take half of that fire damage. So you should only take two. Yeah. Okay. Alright, so let's end this one here. Um, we're gonna have... Next episode will probably be entirely manual battles. Um... He may, if I beat him badly enough, he might flee, which is kind of a possibility, even though they're on hard, they're on hard now, uh, but, uh, not hard enough, apparently. So we will, um, we'll continue this on the next episode. We will see if they have it in them to fight me again, but otherwise it might be just a whole lot of battling and you know what that's going to mean. It's going to mean mass fire bombing. We're just going to throw fire all over the place, burn down the forest, burn down their docks burn down their cities um yeah it's gonna be a good time so thank you for watching I hope you've enjoyed this series so far if you have please like and subscribe i'd really appreciate it 
Um, check the link in the description for my Patreon if you want to support the channel and show up in my games twice as often. You can also leave comments on my videos and then you'll show up in my games sometimes. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next episode.